theme. Uh, I remember I uh, I wrote it in a restaurant in Fulham. Um, and I rushed in and kind of put it down on a table napkin. Um, I have to say, it's a, it, I mean, gosh, you know, nothing is more simple than that. I mean, how many hundreds and hundreds of pieces, you know, that you play on the piano have that in it? But um, it is that thing of being able to take it on, and uh, that once you've got that, you've got that. The, the grandeur of it is, is, is what I think uh, made it happen. Uh, but again, I, I think originally, uh, if I remember rightly, Tim and I thought that it might become a kind of the, the theme of a follow-up to Joseph. And I think I can't even, was it not, I think it might even called Samuel or something. I'd for years wanted to write something about Judas Iscariot, who I thought was a very interesting character. And I'm sure that the uh, artistic success of Joseph encouraged us to go along that route. And nobody, even David Land, who will admit this, thought it was that good an idea commercially. They thought, you know, religion, forget it. The kids aren't interested and... Adults certainly won't be interested in a rock musical about Jesus Christ. Oh, you, 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 you don't know the uh, the opposition that we had. Uh, uh, I say through the variety club, and also through a personal friend of mine, I play cards with Lou Grade. He said to me, uh, mucking around with a subject of that description, you want your bloody brains testing. Uh, everybody thought we were crazy when we submitted a musical about uh, Jesus Christ for production.